We are here at our leadership seminar, um, Philosophy and Practice at Kloster Mühle, and I'm here with one of our participants, Eduardo. Um, it's really great to have you. Um, you've you. participated now for the last couple of days in the German Espen Institute uh, Philosophy and Practice seminar. Um, why are you here? <laughs> <laughs> you know, um, I really had one of these seminar in Italy, and uh, when uh, I had the chance also to come here, I was like, why not? Also, I would like to see how those seminars are organized also outside Italy, of course, and also to, um, to help me, uh, y um, you know, knowing different people and outside the Aspen uh, Italy, where I come from. Uh, and also because those seminars are the perfect uh, uh, occasion, you know, to know people that are working in other companies and to share ideas, to share different point of views, and also, you know, to give my perspective, my contribution to the table. And uh, did you hear any new ideas you take away with you? Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, also, uh, we, we, we also put in play some, uh, some tragedies such as Antigone, and this is uh, uh, really an important part of the seminar. And, uh, uh, you know, looking how people are dealing with the short time uh, uh, delivery is also um, a perfect example of how to learn from others, how to work under pressure, right? So um, more than ideas, it was like kind of uh, looking at different way how people are dealing with the time constraint and delivery. So it's more kind of the methodology side of this. So this is a leadership seminar, which is a little bit different from other leadership seminars. Um, what does leadership mean, mean to you? What is good leadership in your point of view? Yeah, for me, there are many different styles okay, of leadership. Uh, the one uh, uh, that I feel like is more close to how I deal with leadership is the servant leadership. So it's kind of trying you know, to empower people. Uh, to, to, to help all the people in the team uh, to see you as a leader because they want to follow you. You give the example and you are helping everybody else uh, to reach their personal goal. And of course, uh, I, I'm always uh, believing that I in a team, one plus one uh, equals three because there are synergies and because if you have a team of people that are really working well together, you can reach outstanding goals. So, so uh, I, I see leadership in this way. So give an example and reaching the goals of the team, empowering who is part of the team. And you yourself, you work on artificial intelligence issues, right? Um, so there are a lot of ethical questions uh, around this. Does um, a seminar like philosophy and practice help answer these ethical questions? Yeah, for sure, because actually now we see artificial intelligence is again uh, in, uh, in a game part of the ma kind of a main trend out there, okay? So uh, it's here with us since many, many years, but today with the, the new um, computers we have and uh, the, the power of those computers, we can reach really, deep in really new hor horizons, okay? And uh, here, when we are building those kind of systems, they are really complex systems, they can do uh, a kind of generative AI is really uh, impressive, uh, and, uh, uh, and but we need uh, to have those systems to be, you know, ethical. But mm, having the system, eti uh, putting ethics inside the system is not easy. Uh, you really need to, to be e uh, ethic by design. So you need to start designing the, sy the system with ethical principles. And here in the leadership seminar, uh, we, we, we discuss a lot about ethics, also with other people. So everybody brings hi uh, his, her, um, perspective about ethics and also we study ethics through ancient uh, literature, let's say ancient uh, uh, text uh, and this is really really useful because those texts uh, are the, the, you know the starting point for a lot of discussion then is unique for each seminar. And what did you like best about the seminar? <laughs> you know the uh, let's say the Aristotle part uh, uh, dealing with uh, with happiness was really really uh, something I loved because it's actually uh, what I think also is happiness, you know, for me, you know, uh, I really love em helping people, empowering people, um, making people happy, and this makes also me happy. So uh, that's m maybe the, the best part. Well, we are very happy that you participate in our seminar, and we hope to see you in lots of Espen Germany seminars, also on artificial intelligence in the future. Thank you so much uh, for being here over the long weekend. Thank you.